Okay, this is Greg and uh, this is another video about my Agile 3100 and this time I will be comparing this to a Gibson Les Paul standard from 2004. You know, this is obviously not my guitar, my student was kind enough to, 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 to lend me this guitar for today. A uh, few remarks. I uh, I paid for my Agile about I don't know 400 pounds actually dollars plus shipping so in total it was 500 pounds his guitar in 2004 was about 2000 pounds I think this guitar today might be about uh, 2700 pounds which is 2700 right so so this is this doesn't seem to be like a standard really Gibson. I mean, although it 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 it, it looks like standard. I don't know. It 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 just looks too good to be standard. Okay. But why ask him to 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 spare me this guitar? Was this, uh, this was the reason? Uh, it looks pretty much the same as my Agile. So you can't really tell from now the difference. So the one on the right hand side is obviously Gibson. So, the, so the, the major differences obviously are here. The headstock. Machine heads. I need to I need to say that uh, the machine heads on, on this Gibson are not that great. They're called deluxe or something like that. And I've read that they are not that great. By the way, I've got some interruptions from outside. Some somebody is cutting the the tree, so so this is like an interruption. Fine. So let's 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 talk more about what's going on here. Look at the look at this binding here. This is obviously Gibson. It's uh, it's 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 thicker than here. I think this is this maple cup thing. So it looks like obviously Gibson has thicker one. So the the top, the top on a on a, on a Gibson is is probably twice as thick as you've got on Agile. You know what? You can uh, I I know that uh, they they have like an option where you can uh, when you can buy thicker, thicker. Uh, maple cup, you know, on uh, on, uh, on it, but uh, uh, you know, obviously, when I was buying this guitar, I didn't know much about Les Pauls. So, <clears throat> what can I say? They look pretty similar. Uh, I wanna, I wanna tell you one thing. You won't be able to see it from here, but maybe I'll put those two guitars on the floor. I can tell you that Gibson, although it was more expensive, could try. They could try harder to 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 make it uh, look neater. I mean, the finish is is nice, but there are little flaws, you know, here and there. So, so this is a Gibson. Obviously, the the fretboard it, it, it must be rosewood. It's 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 not ebony as as on on, on other guitar. Right. So this is it, and and now time for agile. <clears throat> okay. So so the the, the thing has an ebony fretboard. Uh, I think that the, the, those inlays on on Agile could be could be better. They're kind of uh, they didn't put them neatly. I mean, although it, it still looks cool. I mean, there are some little little like uh, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It, it doesn't uh, look as as cool as it could be. I mean, it's a, it's a quality guitar, but but they could try a bit harder. So. Something about about this Gibson. Look at that. This is the binding, and the and the button. Look, you know, this this color thing. You know, it it looks kind of crabbed for for guitar that costs so much. But 
you know, you're gonna discover something about this guitar very soon. So I'm not saying that this is a bad guitar. To be honest, I'm gonna tell you right away that this Gibson would sound probably better, but I, I, I would I would let you judge it. So this is Agile. Uh, something about my Agile, uh, the I requested this extra wide neck so because it's extra wide. It's thicker, so it's actually much thicker than than Gibson's neck. Okay, so just be aware of that. So this is Gibson again. Yeah, nice looking guitar, really nice. Okay, so this is going to be long video, right? Probably three parts. So wait a bit. Crap. I might actually plug in as well my Hartfield Talon guitar just to show you something because there will be one issue with pickups that I discovered that uh, Edge obviously has some uh, crappy pickups and it it kind of affects the sound as you know so I, I might plug it in as well okay so I'm gonna now sit down and and talk